Why is it we got a spinner? It was just spinning before I came over here. We're gonna pick her up. Oh, she's spinning, she's spinning. Yep, we got one. Oh. Yep, it's on. Here we go. Essentials, bait, tip ups, and auger. Um, we're gonna start drilling some holes. Hopefully, we can find the weed edge from, uh, you know, that we fish in the summer. And we always seem to have luck out here. So, see if we can have some good luck today, Christmas Eve. Let's get it. We got a good at least six inches of ice. Bottom of the ice here. And about six inches, I'd say. Six to eight. Not exactly sure. I don't have my measure out. But looks like we got some good ice. Let's keep drilling. First hole. Alright, I'm gonna show you how I set my tip up. So basically what I do, I start with you know your tip up, get that ready, got your depth finder, hook the depth finder on the, the hook, make sure it's not coming off, because it sucks when you lose it. Alright, then you drop your depth finder down into the hole, and the line will Hopefully spill out. See the tip up spinning. Well, we're just off of the weed edge, I think, because I try to guess how many feet. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve foot leader or uh, twelve for the leader, which we're just off. We might try to go another couple feet towards shore, and then we're gonna work our way down that way, and we might drill another one down this way. So then what I do, I reel in a foot or two of line to get it off the bottom, bait, and let's do that. All right, so now that we got the couple feet of line reeled in, we're gonna grab uh, our first contestant. 
Oh, we got two. Nice big ones. I use shiners for when I'm tip up fishing for northern. Just like this. Take your hook. I try to hook them. If I can show you here. Try to hook them. Uh, right here. Then he's still alive. Lower him down the hole. Don't get tangled in my line. Why did you do this? <sighs> there we go. Alright. Lower him down into the hole. Kind of just got to feed your line down. He'll swim around down there. Keep lowering your line. Then when your line is straight down, set the tip up over the hole. And how you set these ones is you take it and if I can get it set here. Yeah. So when this spins, when the line gets taken out, flight goes up, you got a fish. Boys, we got a spinner. It was just spinning before I came over here. We're gonna pick her up. Oh, she's spinning, she's spinning. Yep, we got one. Oh, oh yep, it's on. Here we go. Here we go. I didn't feel him. Oh, he let off. Ah, oh, shoot, boys. The one that got away. We're gonna set it up, same spot. All right, last step up here. Legally in Wisconsin, you can set up three lines. Um, so we're gonna have three tip ups set out. And this one we're gonna do a little differently. Um, some older gentlemen that I talked to in the area said they only put out three feet of line and that's how they catch their northern they put out three feet of line just under the ice and they catch theirs so we got one pro thermal set at uh right around 11 feet we got a classic fray bill set up at around 12 and a half or no Less than that. Nine feet around. Then we're gonna have this. Three feet under the ice. And this one is a uh, Frayville Classic. So we're gonna see what works best today. I've, I always uh, try to mix mine up just to get more of a diverse uh, bite, I guess. So that way I know, hey, pro thermals are working today. Hey, they like the open sky, you know, they get that light down below the ice. Or, hey, they're right under the ice. Or, hey, they're just above the weed edge. So we also have them, um, we have different depths, we have different tip ups, same bait, same ice, pretty much same location. We have two along the weed edge that I believe, and one just off. So we'll see how we do. And if dad's here, we'll be setting up some more. All right, we got a flag. Oh, and it's been, it's been, it's been, it's been. Let's go, let's go. Hold up. Oh, we got him, we got him. Ooh. This one feels a lot bigger than the last one. 
Oh, yep. There it goes. There it goes. I think that was a pike. Uh, this one was the one that was a foot, two feet, three feet, four feet off the ice. Somewhere in there. Kind of just guesstimate. Ooh. Yeah, big pike, big pike. There we go. Let's go. Look at this girthy guy. Let's go. Alright. If you don't know, pike have plenty of teeth. Uh, look at this guy. Smiling at me. Probably not smiling at me. He's more like, hey, put your hand in the wrong place. I'm going to bite it off. But, same thing. Alright. We're going to grab our lip spreaders and get this guy measured up. Alright. We got beautiful looking pike here. It's getting to be the girthy size, so it's got to be a pushing. At least 24. Uh, they do bulk up for the winter, but the shoulders look a little bit bigger where the Y bones meet. So I'm thinking it's 24, 25. I can't find my measuring tape, but that's what she looks like. She'll be a good eater. And then I'm setting up three more tip ups since my girlfriend's here now. So we'll have total of six lines and then when dad gets here we can set up another three so we'll have a total of nine lines on the water a day so let's get after it boys we got another spinner let's go oh she's taking mine she's taking mine yeah. let's go fish on fish on Seems like another decent one. We'll see when it gets up. Oh. Get over here. Get over here. Let's go. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Don't do this. Don't do that. Don't do that. Yeah, another pike. Get up. No, get in the, the hole. Let's go, boys. We got another pike on the ice. Pliers are a bit rusty. There we go. Let's go. This is probably a little more than 20 by the looks of it. Nice pike. Let's go. Another girthy one. You can tell it's winter. The difference between the pike in the summer and winter is immaculate with the girth of the pike stocking up for winter. Yep, a little bit smaller than the one we had caught earlier, but we're out here. Prime time now. We should be able to get hopefully at least three more, is my hope. All right, let's get one more tip up set and we'll have six tip ups in the water. All right, boys and girls, uh, we were sitting out here on the lake and we got two today. We'll see if we pull in any more as we pick up here but as of right now we have the two we'll measure those when we get up uh to the house there but yep it was a pretty good day for fishing for i think two and a half two and a half hours by the time i got it uh down here so uh you'll be seeing this probably on christmas so, Merry Christmas, and hope you guys have a 
excellent holiday with the family. And, uh, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like and subscribe. Also, comment to see if you, so I know that you guys want to see some more, uh, fishing videos. We'll definitely be going more, so if you guys want to see more of that, we will surely get that to you. So, we're going to pack up here, and we'll see you in the next one. Drive safe. I just want you I just want